Hello everyone and welcome back to Yankee Dab, where of course every day is a train show and I hope you're getting into the holiday season. As a matter of fact, I have been rewriting some of my favorite Christmas carols to showcase some of the products we had today. Are you excited, Engineer Hall? So what is it? Uh, oh, okay. me today. <clears throat> well, instead of a oh, Christmas tree, mm -hmm. oh, bulkhead flat car, oh, bulkhead flat car, how beautiful your loads are. What do you think? Yeah, like six, seven people just unsubscribe from that one. Um, oh. Well, anyway, let's take a look at these 68-foot bulkhead flat cars from Walters here. And I got a bunch of different versions of these cars for your consideration. I got six different ones here. And, of course, I also have different road names and road numbers. Canadian National, we got the BC Rail. This one is the IC. I have here the Southern. Everyone's favorite, the TTX. And then finally, we got some Western Pacific. Now, these are really nice bulkhead flat cars here. And as I said in my flawless rendition of my song here, these flat cars are ready to receive any type of load that you want to put on here. So, Engineer Hall, what type of load would you put on these cars? Now give me a pipe load. Ooh, get a nice little pipe oh, load well, happening that, that here. Detail there. There's oh. a lot of detail happening Something on new. these cars here. And the neat thing about these cars here is they're rather inexpensive too. For example, they retail here for, where is it right here? They retail for $38.98, which is pretty good on its own, right? But we're selling it here at Yankee Dabbler for $27.70, I'm sorry, $29.73. So it's a good deal to get on these cars here. You get a whole bunch of flat hair, uh, flat, flat cars, bulkhead flat cars. Speaking's hard, Engineer Hall. You get a whole bunch of these, get a nice long unit train happening of flat cars here. I think you're really going to enjoy it. And it's just going down the, the rails, you get to sing your song. Oh, you know Mariah Carey is very big. Well, check out this version. All I want is some good sound, better than the ones I found. Make my dreams come true. All I want in my engines is a brand new decoder for you. What do you think? Oh, uh, they literally like everybody just clicked off the video. Ain't nobody watching no more. Some of you might be looking for decoders that add to your engines that you already have. Maybe you're looking to convert some of your old engines here. Well, here at Yankee Dabbler, we have a whole bunch of different decoders so for your op, uh, for your consideration. We have different makes, different things. For example, in the, all these boxes I have here is all NCE. But if you want something a little bit different, check out up here. I have everything from TCS. If you take a look over here, I have everything from Digitrax. If you take a look over here... I have soundtracks. If you take a look over here, everything over here, I got more soundtracks and I got ESU. I got decoder buddies. I got speakers. I got everything that you want here to turn your locomotive. Look over here. I got I got Ring Pro. I got Rail Pro. I'm sorry, Rail Pro. I got Ring Engineering. I got a whole bunch of different things for your consideration here. So look, if you're looking to upgrade your locomotives with some type of um, decoder, speakers, whatever you want, we got it here at Yankee Dollars. Matter of fact, for some of the ESU ones, if you want us to add sounds, you can actually write in the comment section what sound you want us to add to your decoder, and we'll get that loaded on for you, and we'll get it shipped out so you can skip that process of your uh, install and you can build your uh, you can have your engine running in no time with the correct sound so come to yankee dabbler type in what decoder you're looking for and we'll get it shipped out to you so you can finish your project engineer hall apparently doesn't like my songs but i think they're great for example deck the halls with gp40s from 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 tis the season to run gp40s beep 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 ding ding what do you think no, 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 uh, just, just keep going. Just keep going. Go ahead. Go ahead. Want to hear it again? <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. Okay. Anyway, well, I got some Bachman GP40s in N scale for us to check out here. Let's take a look at these diesel locomotives here. Now, these are from Bachman. So, if you're looking for some economically friendly diesel locomotives to run on your layout, here are some for your consideration here. I'm starting out here with that Burlington Northern. I have a very nice looking Union Pacific. I got the Burlington Northern Santa Fe. I have here the CSX, and I'm finally going to round it off with, uh, I don't know what that one is. What is that? Old horse face. 
horse face. <laughs> All right. Well, I got some really neat diesel locomotives here. And look, I know these are Bachman diesel locomotives here, but they're very nice and they're very affordable too. For example, the retail value of these diesel locomotives, they sell for $299, but we're selling them here at Yankee Dabbler for $169.99. It's a great deal to get on these engines here and the gp40 is a standard locomotive a workhorse of the railroads every single railroad had a gp40 in some way shape or form so engineer hall i'm gonna let you pick which one of these gp40s you want to run let's go with the dark feature all right so we're gonna go with this csx are you ready beep 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 no it'd be nice if you're telling me you're turning the camera off while in the middle of my song okay let's start off the dark future Sounds powerful. Where's the bell? Where's the horn? Let's pull her out. Apple. Now arriving, Diesel. My recommendation is you buy all five and have lots of fun. That was cool. So again, the retail value of these diesel locomotives here is $299.99, but we're selling them here at Yankee Dabbler for $169.95. So if you're looking for a great diesel to get on your layout for your end scalers, very economical, friendly one, and one that seems to pull really great, I recommend these Bachman GP40s. Uh, Engineer Hall, I know you haven't liked my songs, but I think you're really going to like this one. Okay, I'm going to see. All right? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I saw Santa running a U25B on my Christmas layout last night. What do you, what do you know? Wait, uh, wait. Uh, I'm sorry, say it again. Uh, um, uh, you were saying something? It's a great song. U25B. Oh, what a fun it would have been if that, that, hey, 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 wake up, wake up, come on. Oh, I'm here, I'm sorry. Anyway, we got an engine from Rapido. We'll just talk about trains. That's it. No, no, no. Here, train. Go look. All right, this is how I like it. Yeah. Train. Yeah. Train. Diesel. Gray. Goes beep. Christian. So this is a U25B from Rapido here, and this is of the Erie Lackawanna. This is a really neat diesel locomotive here. This is by Rapido, and you know Rapido does a lot of great stuff with their detailing here, their sounds. I hope there's some fun Easter eggs in here because I always like hearing the fun sounds that Rapido puts in their engines. This is just a really neat look at diesel locomotive here. And if you're trying to replicate some of the Erie Lackawanna diesel engines here, I think this is a really neat option to go with. As they say in Rapido, some of these trains look better when they derail. Take a look right there. I just noticed something really cool when I turned this upside down. Look, the little drop plate comes up. I mean, just look at the detailing that goes into some of these things. That's really cool there. So, I'm anxious to get this on the rails here. I like the chain that they have here. And I just got a lot of really great stuff happening here. So, let's get this on the rails and find out what it sounds like. All aboard. All right, so I had this U25B on the rails here. Before I get started with all the actual train noises, let's take a look at some of the fun sounds that they put inside these engines here. Let's see what I got. All 
right, so I got an old timey bell. That's kind of cool. Oh, got some Star Wars action. All wings check in. Red three standing by. Red six standing by. Red five standing by. Red button standing by. Red five standing by. Big red standing by. <laughs> red or two are standing by. Helen red standing by. Simply red standing by. So not only do we have Star Wars, we got Family Guy Star Wars. Awesome. What else we got? I'm having trouble with the radar, sir. What's wrong with it? I've lost the bleeps, I've lost the sweeps, and I've lost the creeps. The what? The what? And the what? You know. The bleeps. The sweeps. And the creeps. <laughs> That's not all he's lost. What? Sir. The radar, sir. It appears to be... Engineer Hall, come up to me. There's only one person that would dare to jam me. Lone Star! Sorry, that's from our Spaceball friends. Let's see what else we got here. What that was. Engine room report to secure diesel, pulse and switch the battery. Very well, all ahead two thirds. All ahead two thirds, huh? Mr. Emmett, take her down. Make your guess 150 feet, 10 degree down bubble. 150 feet, 10 degree down bubble. Aye, sir. Chief of the watch, sound the dive alarm. Got the word along the 1MC. The main valve tank bit. Aye, sir, pass you to work. Ah! 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 I just love these little goofy things they put inside of here. All right, let's get the actual train sounds. Take a listen to the bell. Horn. Ooh, I like that horn. Let's go up. Let's pull some flat cars.
This is a really cool diesel locomotive here, and there's a lot of other features that I didn't really bother to mention, but I do have truck lights in there. The cab is actually illuminated there. I got a lot of really neat things happening with this diesel engine. Now, the retail value of this locomotive is $349.95, but we're selling here at Yankee Dabbler for $299.99. It's a good deal to get on a Rapido engine. You always throw that into engineer hall discount and save a little bit of money on that. But I think it's a great engine. It sounds good. It runs good. I love the horn and the bell on that. I, I just kind of like it when I hear different things. I haven't heard that in the diesel that we have done yet. I really enjoy it. So coming to Yankee Dabbler, I only have a couple uh, versions or um, I think I only have three of these in stock. So do not hesitate. If you're thinking about getting them, get one of these engines on your roster today. I think you're really going to enjoy them. Let's do a little recap of all the things that we saw on today's show here. We have from Walther's here, these uh, Walther's 68-foot bulkhead flat cars. And look at the loads that they're carrying. Isn't that cute? We have here these Bachman GP40s. They even match the colors. And then from Rapido here, we had this U25B. As well as all the decoders that we talked about involving NCE, Digitrack, Soundtracks, RailPro, ESU, etc. We got them all here at Yankee Dabbler and they're all on our website. But if you were looking for something that we didn't showcase in today's show, that's all right. You can always go on our website, yankeedabbler.com. So have the search bar what you're looking for and we'll get a pack shipped to you so you can have hours of excitement this holiday season. If you're not already subscribed to Engineer Hall channel, I don't know what you're doing. I mean, hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell for your notifications. I mean, it's just the best show ever. Right, Engineer Hall? It's awesome. We put a, we a great show almost on a weekly basis. On braces? Sorry. Basis. Engineer Hall has been into the eggnog this holiday season already. Hey, hey, don't tell him. Don't All tell right. him that. Anyway, so uh, make sure you click that subscribe button. We're going to conclude today's show. Soon as this is the holiday season, everybody loves the Polar Express, the Pier Market 1225. I saw it a couple of years ago, so I got a nice little video of it going through Michigan. I think you're really going to enjoy seeing the 1225 pulling a consist of cabooses, Frank, uh, passenger cars, there's even a diesel at the end of it. So I get a little of everything for everyone. Now, if you excuse me, since Engineer didn't like any of my songs here, I got to continue writing. I don't know where my pencil is. So I'm going to pretend the screwdriver is a pencil. Oh, here you go. No, here, here, get, get the work. Come on, All right. get the work. So I'm going to write some other holiday songs that I think you'll like. How about this one? <clears throat> buy all these trains, buy all these trains, buy all these trains, buy all these trains. What do you think? Well, keep going. You you on a roll. I like that one. All right. Uh, you, you, you like that I one? I like huh? that one. Uh, how about this? Um, you better watch out. You better not pop. You better not shout. I'm telling you why. I got a GP40 coming your way. Uh, you should say in town. Coming into town. That, that would sound better. But keep riding on your pack. Keep going. Silent diesel. Broken deep. No, that doesn't work. All right, how about mm -hmm. this? Um, hmm. Uh, Christmas, Christmas time is here. Time for diesel, steam, and beer. Ooh, I like that one. Uh, I know you're a kid at heart. 